No, honestly, like the incense I lit doesn't sound doesn't sound all that bad. Doesn't smell all that bad. It's pretty good. Although I just I tend to just like incense though, so there's only ever been like one that I bought that was kind of gross. I don't even remember the name of it. It just trust me when I say it wasn't great. Uh, what do we got here? We got controller vibration on first person Y. I'm assuming that's vertical. Rotation, we'll see. Solo mode, whatever. Cutscene subtitles on. I appreciate the subs, man. That's actually pretty nice. Yeah, accept changes. I'm a, I'm, I, I, I really like subtitles in my video games, so. No video options, annoyingly. I was kind of hoping for some of that. And there's, like, nothing else. Extras, but we probably don't have any of the, like, in-game cutscenes or anything unlocked. I'm assuming you have to actually, like, do it first to get it unlocked, so... Hop right into the game. THQ, let's go, dude. I don't really uh, think of THQ when I think of RPGs. Volition sounds familiar, though. Did they make, like, some bigger name games at some point? List of Volition games. I think they did, man. Um, Descent, Free Space, Summoner. Bro, oh, they made Red Faction. Bruh, how they make Red Faction and this. Red, Red Faction's actually pretty good. And Saints Row, of course, yeah. They also did the Saints Row games. Before they, like, died. Just recently they died. That's crazy, man. <laughs> to think, you know, they went from making... I don't know what Descent is... But they made Summoner, sucked. Then they made Red Faction, which was pretty good. And then made Summoner 2, which, meh, we'll see, I guess. And then Red Faction 2, and then, like, moved on to the Saints Row games. There's another one, Agents of Mayhem, they've released, like, in the middle of all that. I don't know anything about that one, either. I wonder if maybe this is, like, one of those things where the game is just a lot better on PC, you know? Because Summoner did also release for Windows and, and Mac. So maybe that's, like, the secret, you know? We're just playing it on the wrong platform. Although, with that said, Summoner 2, they only did on console. They didn't even, like, try to make a uh, Windows release for it, a PC release, from the looks of it. Unless, like, somebody else ported it or something. Uh, probably not, though. Because, uh, like, the GameCube one was a port, and it's listed specifically on here as a... Excuse me, as a port. Well, that sucks, dude. Put in all that work to grow in that tree, and that shit just got blown up, man. Entering the Tempest. Sorry, I'm just, like, reading about all their games and cancel games and shit now. Oh, they actually had a uh, Summoner 3 planned, according to Wikipedia, at least. Noodle, thank you for the five bits, love. Appreciate you. I'm assuming Summoner 2 just didn't do well enough why they canceled it, but... Story great, reception. We hold them off. We must disengage. Uh, it does say generally favorable reviews, according to Wikipedia. <laughs> Gotta watch out for the blue ladies, man. They're always crazy. Left analog stick to move. Square to attack. Press square two to three times for combos. Uh, combos leave you vulnerable. Hold R1 to block. Head on attacks do no damage when you are blocking. You cannot block attacks to the side. You cannot block spells or certain special attacks. Nor can you move while blocking. Oh. Wait, she's not dead? She looks pretty dead to me, dude. Okay, so they definitely decided to, like, take the combat up a notch. That's for sure. The combat is all, like, real-time. Well, I mean, I guess it was real-time before, but there's actually, you know... It's not slow as fuck. It's still not... I wouldn't call it quick, but... But it's not just the timed button press shit like The Witcher 1 is. I really don't like this camera effect in the beginning of the game here with the ship rocking back and forth and whatnot. It's going to make me sick. 
cute. Oh, yeah, bow doesn't look too bad right now. Okay, we can interrupt spells. That's actually pretty cool to know. Collecting gold from killing these dudes, too, which is cool, I guess. I'm sure that'll come in handy at some point. No shit, dude. We're just figuring this out. I can't, I can't see help. So there's no friendly fire, right? Yeah, no. Is there any more people? Me? Equipment? Oh my god, yeah. Okay, I can figure out how the menu works, game. It's fine. Select lore to learn more about lore, whatever options to do, options help to help. That's fine. I just want to know, like, what all do we do we have? Anything? I'm probably going to, like, try to figure out how to do something later, and now I won't know because I just skipped through it all, but fuck it. Okay, so we have a basic shield, basic sword. Our statuses were fine. Wait, AI scripts to find how a character behaves when not under your control? Ah, we can get a party. AI healer, melee support healer, caster, healer, caster. Ah, okay. That's neat, I guess. Energy minus 25. To highlight a skill set, unassigned skill points, do nothing, I guess. I don't know. Circle to assign skills, some shit like that. Necromancy, revive, dodge, R1 plus X. Ah, okay, so we have a dodge. That's handy. I'm assuming we don't have quests yet. No lore. Reserve summons? Okay. I mean, there's there's stuff here. So wait, the dodge is just, we just step back. Okay. Can't like dodge to the side or anything crazy. Not display auto map. What happens if we just let all these dudes die? Like if we just chill long enough, will they figure out how to do all the killing themselves? I mean, honestly, they weren't doing bad. They seem invincible, so. Two more across. So honestly, we probably could just let them deal with all this shit by themselves, the, the dudes. We have enough health. I don't think we really need to worry about anything right now. I suppose I could be wrong about that, but like... I wonder if it is possible to die in this intro section here. And before, like, we're meant to die. There's a, a scripted death. Maya's been wounded. Hit points represent your current health level. HP is displayed at the bottom. Next to your heart is your stuff. When you hit zero, you die. Mana is your spells. Yeah, we don't have any spells, so... There doesn't seem to be any lock-on or anything, but it does seem to at least kind of lock-on automatically. Like, whenever somebody's near us, we just kind of do it. Or, hear me out, we murder you. Wouldn't we want to be, like, behind him, if at all possible? Because then he can't block. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> Um, it's your uh, main menu, I guess. <laughs> so remember what I was saying about like, I don't think we really have to worry that much. Uh, it was all bullshit. <laughs> Yondu board of the ship, 100, man. Like, that's fucking blue asshole is what he is. What, does he have his little, his whistle thingy? I don't remember what it's called. Can we skip? We can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how game work, game. Okay, so we have to be at least a tiny bit careful. Mostly against against the pirate captain. The rest, everybody else doesn't really seem to matter, but... Pirate captain actually can hurt us. And that knockdown is wicked. We definitely don't want to get knocked down. Come on, you dick. There we go. I haven't lost any health yet. Let's go. What is the normal? I'm assuming the normal down there is just our status? You know, I thought when it popped up and said interrupted, I thought that was like we interrupted a spell or something. 
But now I'm not actually so sure. I didn't notice them doing a spell or anything that time. I want to play the Bethesda made, what was it called? Like Red Guard or something like that? It was like a game, I feel like it was similar to this, you know? It was like an RPG but made for consoles. And I'm just curious how similar it plays. Because this is what the game looks like to me. Do we... Ah, X to pick stuff up. Strength plus 10, blunt. Can't be equipped by Maya. Okay, so useless to us. Higher insignia ring, defense plus 3. Can be equipped by all kinds of people. Ring increases defense when equipped. That makes a lot of sense. Can we just, like, turn off all of the, the hint stuff? Uh, back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Game. I got it. It's fine. Go to the ring slot. Click the ring. See, simple. I know how it works. Yeah, Elder Scrolls Red Guard. That's what it was called. I know very little about the game other than the fact that, like, it did not do well at all. And outside of that, though, I know literally, like, nothing. Okay, I'm being surrounded. I did not agree to this, Mukaki. Yeah, no shit, I'm wounded, dude. I'm being surrounded. We have no, like, AoE or anything like that. Somehow, like, we were doing decent. Now, somehow, we're doing worse than we were in the last one. Oh, my God, dude. There's one down. We even got loot this time. We didn't get any loot last time that I noticed. All right, maybe we just let, like, them deal with them, you know? Do you guys want to go up there and kill the, the pirate captain? Run away, run away, run away. <laughs> this is more or less my plan. Just fucking smack him a couple of times and then run the hell away. Hopefully, before he does that, I'll spin. Oh my god, bro. That hurt. Is there, like, heals around here anywhere? Come on. Oh, God. This is... <laughs> this actually kind of sucks. Can we load from, like, the beginning? No, there's no save games. Okay. Oh, new game then. Again. Um... <laughs> I'm not sure what the hell we're supposed to do. I mean, obviously, we need to kill the dude. Just gotta get good, that's what it is, but... But like, damn, that... That pirate captain is wicked, man. Can we attack out of a guard? No. We have to stop guarding to attack. There you go, maybe the game will take pity and give us all kinds of stuff. Icicle level five? Okay. That actually might be helpful. Can we like, break open? No. I think we could break the barrels open and get some loot. Yeah, we got hit by a spell. Well, it's nice that it, like, told us about the spell. Or, I'm sorry, told us about blocking when we get hit by a spell, even though you can't block spells, according to it. Seems like a weird time to, to give us that info. One eighty smacked with his um. Seriously though, man. She? It? They? They were locked on to me, man. Fair and balanced, one hundred percent. This is the most fair of games, and honestly, like everything so far has just been skill issue. If I just get good, it wouldn't be a problem. Uh, I didn't get no experience because I didn't deliver the killing blow. Seems like that's the only thing that really matters is doing the murder. The rest of it's whatever. I want to get them up here. 
so that they'll, yeah, get distracted by these dudes. I don't want these dudes to actually do the killing, of course, but... But I'm just hoping they can tank some of the hits for me. Yeah, it's not working all that well. Is it possible to, like, make the camera not suck somehow? Like, I missed one somewhere? I oh, don't know. There's more of them coming across still. Okay. I thought that was it. Jesus Christ, game. This is a clusterfuck of a game, dude. Choco, when you played this game, did you ever get past the beginning of it? Because uh, <laughs> I imagine you probably did. I don't know if I'm going to though, man. Just being, just being real with you. I'm about to die to the basic runs this time. Come on, I have the icicle spell though. I'm really hoping the icicle spell does something good. I don't have the highest of hopes, but maybe I don't even know how to use it though. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how equip works. Do we do we equip it? Does it work like a weapon? Necklace, armor, leggings, boots, gloves, weapon. No. Okay. Would it be skills? Press the upper down direction button to highlight a skill set. Unassigned skill points of any are displayed below the portrait. X to assign skill points to the select skill. Circle to unassign. Only skills with flashing point values can be improved. Uh, review spells. Okay. So, like, it shows that we have these powers. How do we actually use them? Stores HP to target. I want to use it, like, on myself, if possible. Hmm. Just under halfway? No shit, man. I mean, I guess when you're, you know, a kid and you have little options for games to play, then why not? Uh, okay, yeah. Is there, like, just an item menu somewhere? There's equip, status, skills, quest, lore, party, options, save, load. No. Is it under party? No, that's in this menu. Hmm. Well... How do we use freaking scrolls, man? Help. <laughs> do you want to get distracted by those dudes? Is it like circle, triangle, X, L1, R1, R2, L2? Oh god. Go ahead, attack. Fine. We got we got this, dude. We don't even need no icicle scroll or whatever the hell it was called. The problem is if we get hit once, we're like dead. Because he's gonna knock our ass down and then destroy us. I'm so ready for this camera to be in a terrible position, too. I love how there's no, like, block animation or anything. We just stand here, and all of the hits just kind of deflect off of us. That's probably my favorite part of the game so far. Super realistic. There we go, dude. What is the blue bar? That must be... Okay, that must be, like, his mana or whatever. No! Fuck! <laughs> we... Bro, we had like a hit left. I thought he was doing like the power attack and the power attack he stops after. Uh, what a hit load. We don't have a save game. One-on-one -on -one combat I actually feel like won't be that bad. But the, the group combat, trying to fight a group of people sucks ass. Maybe once we get party members that help us out or some sort of AoE spell or something like that, it won't be as bad. But right now, yeah, it's not good. Oh, 
that was yeah that was my bad that's fair that's fair it was that run we picked up the scroll though right i'm pretty sure it was we're about to get icicled yep what kind of pirates are running around using magic spells anyways man why can i not hit you dude Lost like half my health to this lady. Yeah, screw him. I'm gonna go deal with these other two people first. I wonder, do they always like... Icicle Miner. Scroll does damage to target, same as Icicle Spell. No AP cost. How do we use you, though? You want a tea latte or a mudslide? I would love a uh, two ginger ginger ale lemonade if you're offering to make me a drink. I don't think you were, but <laughs> if you want to offer to make me a drink, I would, I would love one of those, love. Nope. Oh no, I was blocking! You bitch. Um, they must have hit me from the side. I ended up dying. Sears, that's fucking terrible, bro. <laughs> pun of the stream goes to Chocobo. Worst pun of the stream. Sorry, I uh, forgot that part. How do you even make that? Uh, like a shot, uh, maybe a little more of the two gingers whiskey. And then we die to these dicks. Uh, and then dump some lemonade powder down in there, or not lemonade powder. Sorry, some some lemon, like the like the true lemon powder down in there, and then fill the glass up with with uh, ginger ale. I mean, I guess technically we're no worse for wear than we were last time, right? Because, like, it's one hit and we're dead. Same as last time. Uh, two. I would prefer two, I think. Honestly, I feel like trying to attack the same time as this other dude is just going to fuck me up more. So I'm just letting them do their thing. And honestly, if they're, he can somehow kill him for me... I mean, I still hope to get the last hit, because I... Oh, fuck. That scared me, man. Come on, bro. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, keep doing that power attack. I like that. No, oh, that was so close. I'm so glad we hit him. I thought he was doing a power attack. He was not. I mean, hey, if he doesn't want to block anymore, yeah, do do something again. Come on, bro. We got this. Let's go, dude. Hell yeah. Okay. Finally, it only took like five trines. I said two. I don't think, maybe you didn't hear me, but I'm pretty sure I said it out loud. I was definitely thinking two at least. <laughs> but yeah, two. Two lemons, please. Shot, shot and a half of two gingers whiskey. Uh, two, two lemons. And um, fill up the glass with ginger ale. Wasn't that another pirate lady? Why are you helping us? I don't trust her. Where's Prince Nehru? On the Isle of Teomura. You'll find his lair near Waterfall. Wait, I thought we just killed the pirate captain. I'm so confused, man. If you lie to me, you'll wish you were dead. I oh, did we capture him? Okay, we must have captured now, him. Never mind. Queen of Halasar want with Nehru? He has something that belongs to me. 
Hardy received Flaming Cutlass. So a new sword. Strength plus eight, speed plus five, slashing fire. 30% chance of casting fire arrow on hit. So wait, does it actually shoot out an arrow or like... That doesn't make much sense to me, man. The lords of Tiamora once ruled these waters, and to the dragons of the island they sacrificed their daughters. That's Prince nice. Neru That's now nice. lived in the Worm Lord's palace, but I did not fear his pirates. I had come for the Book of the Prophets, stolen by a traitor from my sanctum. As we rode to the shores of the island, I swore to reclaim what was rightfully mine. Was it magic like outlawed or something in the first game? Or was it only like a specific kind of magic? I remember so little about it, man. I kind of want to play it again just because I like RPG games. <laughs> Even though it's not good, I just want to I just want to like the story, the lore. Give me the lore, dude. 20 years after Joseph summoned the power of wrath. Okay, so this is a sequel. The rain stopped. We'll find Nehru's lair hmm. near a waterfall, or so the pirate said. We're fools to heed his counsel, but let's look around. Lore updated, quest journal updated. R2 to switch control between the two peoples. Each character has a different set of skills and spells. Press the left or right directional buttons to access the skills and skill menu. Press select button to enter solo mode. Uh, blue flames behind a portrait indicate skill points to distribute. Okay, uh, so select for solo mode. What is solo mode? Does that mean the other person just doesn't follow us? Leave solo mode. Yes. Okay, yeah, and then they come back. Ah, okay. Could we do this earlier if I had pressed the directional buttons? I don't know if I ever actually pressed them. I might have just kind of ignored them. Oh, oh, this is how we use items. Okay. Scroll reveal stats of enemy target. Sucks that that's a scroll. Scan is like a really helpful ability, actually. How do we switch people? Uh, press circle to use. I didn't mean to actually do that. Can I cancel it? No valid target. Well, yeah, that's fine. Um, square X. X selects. Triangle. Okay, there doesn't seem to be a way to deselect, sadly. So, I guess we'll just do heal. Oh, nope. Okay, never mind. We won't do heal. There it is. R2. R2 switches. What abilities do you have? Sneak. Makes you undetectable unless you're in enemy's line of sight. And then you have access to the same items. I don't think I did ever say which one you wanted to actually love. I apologize. Uh, okay, we can save the game. We definitely gonna want to do that. Because if it's anything like Red Faction, then there's not going to be any freaking checkpoints in the game. So if we'll die, we'll just have to start over from the beginning, and I don't want to. I don't want to have to do that again. That's not. Mm -mm, no, no thanks. Uh, so Sangaril. Isn't there? How do we select your AI? Oh, that's right. They did get level up too. Okay. So by default, she's a support. Speed, strength. Sure, I guess. I mean, just doing whatever has set to default seems pretty decent. Equip, yeah, 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 no. I want to, I want to level up, please. Here we go, skills. Um, okay, so we can make her better with sword weapons, assassination evades incoming attacks so is this like default when they're not being like how how is it a better how does leveling it up assist us do we dodge quicker do we dodge farther back increases the frequency of attacks when ai controlled okay that actually kind of is helpful oh is this like the different levels maybe i don't remember shit about this game me neither man it's fine <laughs> 
Or are these all abilities we already have? Uh, I mean, she already has stealth. I'm tempted just to give her more sneak skill. Makes you invisible unless you're moving. Makes you undetectable unless you're in enemy's line of sight. Uh, you know what? Just be better with swords. Skill limit reached. Must level up to assign more points to the skill. How do we actually assign? Oh, that one's not blinking, so we can't. Okay. Oh, damn it. I had steam pop up on my screen. Go away. I need to... I'm trying to see. Okay, yeah. So this must be, like, all things we can already do. Because whenever we add another level to assassination, we get another ability. We get a uh, chill and flicks ice damage. Step change. Okay. And then we have decreased damage received from physical attacks. Can't do that. So this is our dodge ability. Necromancy. Target immune to death spell seems kind of cool. This does nothing for us. Leveling it up. I'm assuming if we continue to, it'll get like better and better. And then, yeah, just being better with swords seems always good. Fine. That that seems great. Um. Okay, what are the red marks on the map? Points of interest. The inscription reads, Azelum II, Wormlord of T T Teomora. Was it the Tiku? No. Or Tiku? Toucan. That's what it's called. We're not leaving without the Book of Prophecies. Fair enough. What's the auto map? This. Uh, I'd still like it on the screen at least, yeah. The Teo Murns carved a warning on the base of the statue. Beware the daughters of Sakasan. What's wrong with the daughters of Sakasan? Wait, this is a point of interest? Shipwrecked upon those rocks. Perhaps we should have a closer look. Can we go down? We cannot. I guess jumping down would be too much of a hassle. There's something wrong here. Shall I scout ahead? No, wait here. I mean, I say go for it, but whatever. That's Be considerate, odd. bitches. There's something beneath this rock. Why does it glow purple when you step on it? <laughs> That's freaking weird, man. If I stepped on a rock and started glowing purple, I don't think I'd walk into the middle of it, personally. Why does it remind me of a fucking wow. asshole, man? Like, right. Stay where you are. <laughs> the way it was pulsing. That was weird, man. Rocks aren't supposed to pulse like that. Maybe don't just stick your hand into random pillars of light. How's she even alive still, dude? This lady should be dead right now. I mean, I'm glad it seems to have worked out this time, but I think she just got really lucky. I'm assuming that gave us some sort of new power. That's what it looks like, at least, you know? All glowy and whatnot. Is it an AoE? Because an AoE is what I really want. Oh! Oh, is this a summon? Wait, were we replaced by that thing? We didn't summon it, we became it. Your Grace, are you hurt? What just happened here? I don't know, but this has something to do with the prophecy. A circle to transform into the blood summon. I can remain in her summon form for a limited time. The higher Maya's summon skill, the longer her time limit. If the summon HP reaches zero, it turns back into Maya. Maya gains access to new skills and powers in her summon form. Press the left or right directional button to access them. Okay. I mean, that's a free extra health bar if we're, like, in a tough spot or whatever. Statue of Princess Miyoka. She was sacrificed to the dragons of Tamora. 
Sucks to be you, lady. Uh, let's keep going to the right wall, I think. Oh, chest. Oh, uh, it was like trapped? Oh shit, it's still trapped. Okay, um, interesting. How do we deal with that? <laughs> eh, it's fine. Miscellaneous, can we equip from here? No, doesn't seem like it. Equip. I'll give her the ice ring. And then, presumably, we can only use skills from the menu here. Heal. Pass on myself. Is it timed? No, we can just use it as much as we want. Well, I mean, we have limited AP, MP, whatever you want to call it, of course, but... Ah, thanks, love. Oh, it's in the new cup. How fancy. Hmm. You know... The first time I tried that drink, I wasn't so sure about it. And now after trying the drink again, still not so sure about it. <laughs> but it's not actually bad. It's just, it's interesting. It's a drink. I'll say that much. Now, I think I like it. I think I do. Description reads, The Worm of Vengeance. How are we supposed to like, oh, hi. Sorry, I kind of forgot how to play the game. Are we supposed to be, like, killing these weird tree things? That- that looks like magic. We can't dodge magic- or can't dodge. We can't, uh, can't block magic. My god, our companion over there sucks, too. Do we, is this like one of them games where you need to be switching back and forth between people to not just get completely wrecked? Seems like our, our mana may respawn, respawn, refill, regen pretty quickly. Either that or there's like something, maybe dealing damage causes regen, I'm not sure. The Worm of Wisdom. Okay, so there's a bunch of worms, I got it. In the name of the prince, who goes there? Nobody I here. Don't mind us. Answer. Tell Nehru I've come for the book of the prophets. Oh, I've got your prophecy right here, Queenie. I was waiting for that. Is he actually gonna like come down and fight us? I'm happy to murder the dude. Oh, did she just inflict slow on them? That's pretty cool. I mean, she's like an assassin or whatever, so some like... I don't know. Poisons or something? Collecting, collecting a bunch of gold. Gets or shift from Gaudair. One of the crates holds an artifact. The worm's eye. A dragon's eye in the center of a crystal orb. Are artifacts just for selling then? What do we do... I mean, it's cool that we found it or whatever, but what's the point? I wonder if we should explore the rest of the island before continuing on this way, since this seems quite possibly like the right way to go. I mean, there's a line of pirates, and we're looking for I can hear the, water the pirate king or whatever. We're getting closer to Nehru's lair. Hmm. Yeah, Nehru, that's his name. Revive, that's nice. And a cure potion. Also removes harmful status effects. That's cool, I guess. Unrelated, I'm listening. Uh, restore AP. Why AP, man? I really feel like it should just be MP, honestly. Uh, oh, that's right, we can't use skills from here. No, just, just yeah, heal. Oh yeah, the line of pirates completely unrelated to the pirate dude we're looking for. 
Yeah, you're right, you're right. My bad. We'll just turn around and go the other way. Obviously, it's a scapegoat trying to get us to waste our time. Lots more tree bros. Hi, tree bros. I'm hitting the wrong button. Don't mind me. Oh, they dropped something. A brain worm. A rare parasite that feeds on the brains of tree sentinels. Again, how is that useful to me, though? Fuck. What do we do with these, these pads on the ground, man? Hmm. I'm not quite sure. I don't see any option to, like disable them or anything it seems like pretty much as soon as we step on it, it just activates game doesn't seem until your party member just drops dead because they're a dumbass um okay still jank yeah definitely jank no valid target for spell wait how close do i need to be R revive? Okay, get her off there before she dies. Many thank. Go ahead, yeah. Just honestly, this is a much easier way to get heals. It's <laughs> just a freaking, um, uh, like, yeah. Hold on, I gotta turn off my camera so I can adjust like the way I'm sitting, but. I can't, like, be on camera today. <laughs> there we go. Oh, shit, that's probably gonna break the camera, too. Uh, Camera back on. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Son of a bitch. It's fine. It's super easy to fix. Click here, click here, click, click, apply. There we go. Beautiful. I'll just leave that menu up. Okay, uh... Uh, sure, let's kill more dudes, I guess. <laughs> Maybe we can get some more brain worms or whatever the hell they were called. Uh, you're using magic, I believe, so try to run away from it. Yes, that looks like another trap. Energy resistance, okay. Maybe... No, but like, how would we get around it, I guess, actually? I was gonna say, it kind of looks like, or I was wondering maybe if we went invisible, if we could get through using this, the blue lady's ability. But like, we need to be able to get around it at least. I guess, yeah, I mean, I guess if you just run through it fast enough, it's fine. Carvings tell a story of twin sisters. Their magic could heal the most grievous, grievous of wounds. Rue, hello! Got a cold, so it wasn't allergies. That sucks, man. I'm sorry to hear that. So that's just free heals? Hold on. Well, then, in that case, you go up here, too. Yeah. Twas not indeed. I'm sorry, man. That, that seriously, that does suck. I absolutely despise being sick of any kind. I don't even, I don't care if it's just a cold. Like, it sucks. <laughs> the Worm of Songs. I'm already so lost with this map though, too. This level design is a choice. See, I don't really care about taking damage now as long as we don't die, because I can just do this and now I'm fine. Finally, like, wait, you could, why, why couldn't you rejoin the stream? Speaking of, is anybody having any problems, like, with watching in 1080p? Carvings describe the disappearance of five artifacts from the island. On the Feast of pa Pelagia, our Lord Olgason prayed to, at the shrines. Vengeance, village, and songs, wisdom, and luck. To his amazement, the relics of the five were missing. A mercy on us, cried our Lord. Mercy to the people of Tamora, said the Worm of Wisdom. She who restores our relics shall find good fortune. Okay, so this is that relic that we find. I'm assuming, like, maybe we find the worm. Like, we, we place the relics in the worms, maybe, that we've been finding. 
Worm Lord of Tomorrow. No issues, not me. Told you network error, Noodle. Okay. Well, I'm glad it started working for you now. Chaser TV mentioned to me, I think it was earlier today, that for some reason he can't watch in like 1080p most of the time. Bro, who's healing you? Is it that one in the back back there? Fuck that guy. No heals. Healing is exclusive to player characters, thank you. Get wrecked. What is... What are you? The worm of luck? How do we know... Which worm our thing goes to? Trapped is... Oh! Nothing happens? Okay, well that's nice, I guess. It would have been even nicer if, like, the traps didn't constantly refire over and over again. Like, we already got all those things. And there was still that one trap that we walked across that didn't seem to have a, a switch here, too. And there was no way around the traps. I mean, I guess maybe if we went, like, a completely different direction, then maybe, but... That eye is interesting. What, on this? No, that doesn't have an eye. That has absolutely nothing. Just blank as hell. The five polygons that makes up its model it didn't have any room left for eyes. I don't know. <laughs> I don't even know where the eye was. Oh, the inspect icon. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it's hard to miss. I'll say that much about it. Worm of Vigilance, okay. Um, sure. We might as well level up. Since we got it. Skills. Mm. Do everything but blunt weapons. Parry would be nice. Just decrease damage taken. What does this give us? Okay, we can use fire attacks. L1 plus square. It's kind of cool. Necromancy, the next level gives us nothing. Again, I, I have to assume that like if we keep leveling it up, though, it would get better and better. That makes it last for an extra 10 seconds. I'm just going to dump another one into sword weapons, I think. It's not like we're keeping these characters for the long run anyways, so... If we screw them up too bad, who cares? Uh... Where haven't we been yet? Over here? Can we... No. Wait, center on selected? Vigilant Shrine, no. I was hoping we could put like a, a marker down or something like that, but no luck. So from where we are, we just want to like go... This way? I'm pretty sure it was this way. I should be disarmed now. Yep. Yeah, okay, okay. I see it on the map. We good. Oh. Enemies respawned. Okay. That's unexpected. I wonder, like, the third party character, does she only get experience if we, if we don't? Is it the same where, like, she only gets experience if she gets the kill? Maybe we need to switch between people to help keep their levels balanced? I hope that's not the way it works, but... I have a small suspicion that it is, though. Didn't it show this whenever we did... Whenever we pulled one of those levers. Hmm. Guess it doesn't really matter. Huh? 
I have no idea like where we've been and where we haven't been. Oh, cool. We can zoom out. That's handy, I guess. Oh, let's check our our quests. Prince Nehru's lair. No, Dama Savora stole the book of the prophets. Okay, no, we. That's like our main quest line still. It's all our main quest line. Optional. Return the Worm of Lux artifact. Okay, yeah. So we're we're looking for artifacts and the worms they go with. Were any of these worms? No. There are some up here, though. So we did get one at least, right? Still not sure how to check just our items. Other than going into here, I guess. Shalaneous items. Uh, quest items, there we go. Yeah, it doesn't tell us whose it is, though. Dragon's Eye in the center of a crystal ward. What did it say at the top? No, it just said Worm's Eye, okay. Yeah, so, uh, I guess we just keep clicking on people and it'll tell us if it's the right one. Form of Vengeance. Can we, like, do we use the item? Item has no use here. Okay, so not you. Were you a worm? No, this would just had a... Oh, no, it is. Worm of Wisdom. Nope, can't use it here either. Mm. These were worms up here, were they not? A couple of them. We're still missing one, though. If these are two here... Artifact vanishes. Lost the worm's eye. New inscription magically appears. Does your enemy fight with spells or sword? Both, but more swords than spells. Defense increased by five. Party gained 50 XP. I mean, I'll take it. That's nice. Thank you. Can also level up this lady. Singaral. Um, nimble attack. More attacks are nice, and then, you know what? Let's do more assassination stuff. I don't know. No, let's just make, I don't know, just make your weapons better. It, I don't see why you would ever not want to just make your weapons better. I mean, I guess the special abilities could become super powerful at some point or something, but. Ah, we never went this way. Oh, wait, it loops around. Damn, never mind. Is my drink good? Yeah, as good as this drink can be. It's not like the best drink in the world, but it's good. It's up to par. Yeah. Many thank love. He dead. I'm assuming after we finish the main quest, we can still do stuff here. Since, like, it shows the boat to go back to the world map or whatever. Oh. Shit, wait, what? The line of pirates really was unrelated, huh? Is there... We heard the waterfall and everything. There wasn't, like, any way... Like, a bridge up here or something, right? No. Okay. Guess we just keep just keep walking and hoping for the best. That's what I normally do. Where else haven't we been yet though? We go no, that's a dead end. That's just telling us to do do the do the things. Yeah, and we'll just keep following the right wall. Oh, this looks like another dead end here. Or not a, like a dead end, but another way we haven't gone yet. Yeah, okay. What are you? Hold the bridge. Princess... This princess's name was Decilla. She wrote songs about the heroes of Tamora. I mean, that's nice and all, I guess. Whatever. I 
I wish we could we could focus on a single enemy. Like until they're dead instead of swapping between them. Crossbow can be equipped by Singarel. There's pirates drop this key, the lair key. That's handy. Can you have you can probably only have one weapon equipped at a time, right? Oh, no, you can have two. Uh, well, she has, like, two hands. So if we swap this to... Wait, why won't it? Strength increasing the piercing damage inflicted. Crossbows are two-handed weapons. So does that mean we need to unequip the other ones in order for that to work? Strength plus seven, strength plus eight. The flaming cutlass, eight and five. That also a two-handed? How do we unequip weapons? Is it nope, this is gloves. I'll go attributes. Circle? Help. Select? No. Square? No. Triangle is back. Circle is nothing. X is no. Select is nothing. Start is nothing. I don't know how to unequip weapons. Rank plus 21. Speed minus 5. Can be equipped by Singaro. Or Yeah, and that's... That's your name? You're saying Garol? Uh, uh, what? Okay, I don't know. I guess it's fine. We also can't equip the Flaming Cutlass, though. Oh, well, that can only be equipped by Maya, by us. So that's fair. Yeah, that one. that one's fair. But how do we... Switch to the crossbow. Whatever. It's fine. Who cares? The worm lords sacrificed their daughters here. That's nice. The Winari have a secret, your grace. If a child of royal blood drowns, her spirit may return. Find something she treasured and bring it to the place of her death. She may desire it enough to return. Have you ever done this? The Minari never drowned, Your Grace. I guess that's why they're pirates, man. That makes a lot of sense. Not being able to drown would be pretty handy for the whole pirating life thing. We should probably save again before we end up dying or something. Definitely okay with overwriting a save. That's that's fun. It's locked. Uh, we do have a key. Hmm somewhere. Lair key, probably? Door unlocked. I wonder if it's possible... Like, with those tree dudes, do we just use the brain worm against them? Is that the point of it? I, I still don't understand, like, what we got the brain worm for. I don't... I don't know. Your followers are displeased, my lord. Why? Because I won't <laughs> let them murder children and ravage the fisherman's daughter. That's... You are too merciful. I just realized there's no lip-syncing at all, man. They didn't even try. I will not be Prince Nehru forever. Your patrons may be happy, but Munari's city is far away. There are many of us, and only one of you. Is this the I game's way of showing us he's much, like, stronger than the rest? I think this is the game telling us he's much stronger than the rest. Oh, he's he's a monk. Okay. That's handy. Or handy? Fancy is what I meant to say. Are we going to end up recruiting him? Freaking finger waggle, man. I 
need to get one of those for my hair. The moon blade thing that he has. Bloody Whipping pirates. my hair around is a... I don't know, a lethal weapon. <laughs> no ability selected. Okay, that's fine. Can we... We still can't, like, break things, right? No. That's too bad. Okay, that unlocked a lot of stuff. Whenever we cross that threshold. No shit, you're under attack. What am I being hit by? It hurts, whatever it is. Somebody over here using magic? I'm dead. Oh, it's you! Bro, and it homes? Oh my god, that was super close. Okay. We do have... Um... A revive thing, right? Yeah. Use on her. And then she can heal us with her magics. Thankfully, the magic doesn't, like, drain to zero whenever you die. So our Pirate King has a map of Halasar. Does he hope to plunder our trade routes? Good question. I wonder. Are you gonna... You gonna use heals, dude? You should probably heal yourself first, man. I was gonna say, your health is much lower than mine. You're not going to do a very good job at healing me if you're dead. Just throwing that out there. Go ahead, heal yourself one more time. No? Okay. That's fine, then. Ugh. Hard to receive Tamarin coin. On one side of the coin is the bust of a worm lord, Dukon the fourth. On the other side is a young woman aiming a crossbow. Hmm. Question of the day, you're stuck in an elevator with your top three video game crushes. How do you make the most of the awkward encounter? Uh, <laughs> look, I'd like to remind everybody, these are selected by AI. Um, what would even be like video game crushes, man? I mean, it's gotta be two of them from Final Fantasy VII right away, right? You gotta have Aerith and Tifa, like instantly. They gotta be in there. Um. Who would be like, who else would be a video game crush though? I have no clue. I gotta figure out who the third one is. Maybe one of them? I don't know, man. I don't really have like that many video game crushes. So I think it's gotta be both for me, dude. Honestly. While we're talking about Final Fantasy VII, I don't remember her name, but in the Final Fantasy VII Remake DLC, there's one girl that's cute as fuck. I can't <laughs> I don't remember her name, but I wouldn't really say she's a crush. Don't know enough about her for her to be, but hmm. parchment cut in the shape of a circle. You are unable to decipher the writing. That's really handy, I guess. <laughs> Bro, what are some other women in video games that I've played? Since you're ace and demi as fuck, I panic. <laughs> that's not how you make the most of the awkward encounter, though. How do you make the most of it after the panic settles, you know, like Fran <laughs> from Final Fantasy 12, Fran? <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> there was well read for a pirate. The Gonic Heresy, a chronicle of the Silurian Crusade, Crusade Proceedings of the Inquisition. Um, I don't know, man. Final Fantasy X, not really. I mean, like, oh, it can be equipped by Maya. Why did I think it couldn't be? What's her name? I don't even remember the main, like, woman's name in Final Fantasy X for some reason, even though we just played it. But, like, she's, she's nice, but I wouldn't call her a crush. Metal Gear Solid games, not really. All of them people are crazy. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, run away, run away, run away. Oh, bro, what do you do in the face of that spell? That spell sucks. Uh, Final Fantasy 12, not really. What other, what other games exist? <laughs> Definitely nobody in Pokemon. Kingdom Hearts, everybody's kids, so fuck that. Uh, 
Mario <laughs> Prince Princess uh um Daisy. There you go, dude. Like or Peach. Either one. I don't care. Take your pick. Who's the new one? What's the new one's name? The the frozen lady knockoff. There you go. She can be the third one. Even all the prin princesses? What do you mean even all the princesses? Oh, maybe you're a bit behind. You might be a bit behind. <laughs> there you go. Just <laughs> all three. All three. The, the, just Daisy, Peach, and whoever the the newest one, the Frozen knockoff one is. That's that's going to be my three video game crushes. And um, I don't know. I would beg them for a kingdom. <laughs> Oh no, not all the princesses are kids in Kingdom Hearts. But Rosalina uh, No. Rosalina was like Am I mistaken? That was like Oh fuck. Hold on. Google. Google. Rosalina. Oh, it is Rosalina. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. That's her name. Princess Bowsette. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you guys remember the memes? That's uh, that's my video game crush right there. That's like, get her in a, get her in a uh, elevator for me. No, I don't know, man. Oh, the princesses in Kingdom Hearts though, no, but they're all just like the Disney princesses or whatever. Which, uh, do I care about any of them really? No, I don't think so. <laughs> like, meh. The real question is, how do you make the most of it? Like, honestly? Like, what are you... Legitimately, what, what are you gonna do? You know? You're not gonna do anything. Like, you're just gonna... You're just gonna sit there awkwardly and... Get out of the elevator as quickly as you can, you know? That's... That's what's actually gonna happen. So... I don't know. I guess just be friendly? Just try to be nice? Maybe they won't hit you by the end of the elevator ride? If you're lucky, you know? Singaro leveled up again. Good for you, dude. Uh, no. Not solo mode. Skills. Other dude. Bow weapons. Um... I mean, do we even have the ability to use bows? I haven't figured out how to make that work yet. Okay, so that does nothing for us. Right now. What happens if we give two points to assassination? Do we get anything new then? We do. We get sacrifice. Double damage, but you sustain half damage. That kind of... I don't know how I feel about that. I think we're just going to give another one to nimble and another one to sword weapons, man. I mean, I feel like for the long haul, stealth would be pretty handy, but since we're just playing for another, like, half hour or so, meh. Oh, I forgot that she can transform. That would actually be pretty useful in... Oh, frick. I didn't mean to actually do the summon. That's fine. We'll just have to make the, use, the most of it. Yeah, I've been watching G4. Yeah, dude. Things about to get awkward up in here. I miss G4 though, I'm not even gonna lie. G4 was pretty The Queen of Halasar. What brings you to Tiamora? Iffy to be honest, but like it had its good its good moments. I'm willing to make an offer. I don't negotiate with thieves. I never stole from you. I merely took from one who did. Now Halasar is under attack, and you need my help. Go to bed, Rue. You're sick, man. For sure. I hope you feel better at least a little bit tomorrow. The named Crobolus leads the invasion. He's the Hierophant of Urath. We have no quarrel with Medeva or its gods. Have you ever heard of the Aranagoth? I haven't come here to argue theology. You're a long way from Halasar. The war may be over before you sail home. What do you propose? A simple trade. I'll give you the book and bring you to Halasar. In return, you give me Crobolus. Does your ship fly? Yes, he'll be in the palace by dawn. <laughs> but first we need to open the bay gates. You'll find a gem. I'm guessing that's a normal thing for ships to fly in this universe, because he bay. spent no time at all on that revelation. On it's just, does your ship fly? Yes. And then just kept on going. Wait, so we can't even kill this dude? Bro. 
transform for nothing. Wait. Uh, well, no, I guess there was a mutiny. I was gonna say, does that mean we won't be attacked by pirates anymore? But, nah. They didn't like him anyways. What kind of things does he have? Fire arrow, enchant fire. Then the same normal, like, stuff that we have. Okay. Uh, we should equip the... Oh. Can we equip things on the summon? No. I mean, that makes sense. A pirate insignia ring. There you go. You can have that. Congrats. Good for you. No, we should explore a little bit more. We didn't find like any of the insignias yet or anything. Oh, besides the one, but we still need, still need what four more. Plus, with how easy we're dying to magic spells, it'd probably be pretty handy to level up again. But I guess. We haven't found like any way to to increase our, our magic defense yet, other than that, that one statue whenever we turned in the thing. So unless we get lucky and get a do that again, we may just be SOL on the whole magic defense. There's the skill, the parry skill, which seems to let us increase our melee defense. But it's not melee defense that we really need to worry about right now. Right, because if we go to skills... Increased damage received from physical attacks. Yeah, it's only physical attacks. Uh, Before we do that, can we... So two points here. Kills target. Oh, undead only. I don't know how often that's going to come up. I guess we'll go ahead and put one into it, and then one into parry. Nimble's only when we're not using them, like the AI controlled. I don't plan on having our AI controlled that often. This is most likely going to be our main character. So we'll start working necromancy up, because that seems like our main sort of magic type, and then parry for less damage. All that a day there. Do we get a full heal when we level up? It kind of seems like it, eh? I noticed ever since we died, our sword's not on fire anymore. It does seem to still be doing its ability. It's like we get flashes of fire every now and then. Like right there. So I think it's still working as intended, but... But it doesn't have like the, the fancy effect anymore that it had. Treasure map among these bones, the path leads through that door. Oh, we don't actually get to see the map? Why do I feel like it's a trap? Gem in the eye of the skull. Okay. Oh. Shit. I was hoping it would be another one of the insignias or whatever you want to call it. Killed these people? Did the worms of Tamora live in this cave? Maybe? Gunsons have an emerald ring. Appears to be valuable. I'm assuming things that say valuable somewhere in the descriptor are literally just... To be sold. Health potion and a gold case. A golden loot. The seal of Tamora is etched into its cover. Interesting. Okay. Stolen goods. Oh, same thing. How strange. This wall has four small keyholes, but there's no door or lock. More puzzles, eh? I don't remember getting anything related to ease. This epic was composed in honor of Mioka, a renowned huntress of Tamora. The poem is dedicated to the father of the poet, Tuscod the Third. Barrels of Ale. I mean, I'm positive there's something else in that room, but it. Uh, but I have no idea, like, how to. Or what? I'm assuming there's something we need to find before we can really do anything else in there. Can we actually, like, play the song? Probably not right now. Can we, like, use items together? Because, like, seeing the paper circle and the coin, I kind of want to, like, wrap the paper around the coin and see if that does anything, but... 
but I don't... It probably doesn't, though. But I'm trying to get, like, a little comfortable here. Hold on one sec. Oh, shit. I forgot to change the category again. I keep doing that. It's fine. I'll fix it now. Summoner 2. There we go. Good enough. Alright. Uh, yeah, but I don't think we can, like, use things together or anything. Uh, because, like, if we grab the paper circle. Yeah, I mean, it just says paper circle. It's interesting we can use items as the summon. Can't like. Hmm. Okay. Just keep exploring, I guess, man. I mean, we could just leave too. That's always an option. Say fuck it to all of the side quests and things going on here. I can't go on. Why? What's wrong? Huh? The Unseen. Their presence is strong here. The Unseen live below Minari City, if they exist at all. We must leave this island, Your Grace. I'm not leaving without my book. We already figured out how to get the to book, but anyways, um... What are the Unseen? Okay, we should probably, well, once it'll let us, we should probably save just to be safe. In case the Unseen are, like, super dangerous or something. Whatever those are. And then let's just, let's just go. Just head up here and see what happens. I'm guessing the Unseen are, like, invisible. <laughs> Invisible bastards, are you an unseen? What is this? Interact. Vice has a fossil depression as if made to hold a gemstone. I mean, we do have a couple gemstones, do we not? Um I guess just the small ruby is the only one we have. No, doesn't work, okay. Yeah, maybe maybe we have to come back here at some point or something for for a lot of this stuff. I mean, it is an island full of pirates, so I wouldn't be surprised, like, say, the insignias if they had been found and sold off by now. The game could tell me that, and I would I would totally accept it. That seems reasonable. This is the exit. No, we'll skip that for a second. That might be it, though, actually. Have we been everywhere? Because this is this room here. Nothing in here. And then I think the next one is... The dude. The dude that we came here to find that ended up being... More or less nothing. Oh, no, never mind. Maybe we haven't been down Dharma here before. Sephora. Serving with faith and valor, I see. Have you no more retainers to run errands for you? You stole the Book of the Prophets. I take such things personally. Don't be so naive. I wasn't acting on my own volition. Many oppose you and your outrageous claim to Halazar's throne. You shall stand before that throne and answer for your crime. And may Halazar abandon you as I have done. <laughs> I will send for you. If you're not here, our soldiers will have orders to kill. Okay, why don't we just kill her now? <laughs> I, don't, I will send oh for no. you. Whatever, okay, well. That seemed kind of pointless, but. Priceless carpet wo woven in Lanelli, capital of Mediva. Priceless, you say? Or do you mean priceless as in, like, literally? It sucks. 
painted in some place. Some history books. Absolutely nothing. Is this a chest though? Gem found in Nehru's guest quarters and emits a strange glow. Okay. Well, I mean, that's a gem. Maybe we can put that gem up in the... Oh, shit. It's weird how people spawn in. It seems to be event-based. Fine, whatever. It's just unexpected every time I come into a room and there's another person or group of people here. This was the way to the dude, I'm guessing. Right? Yeah. Yeah, that's the dude. So screw this. Turn around. I need to at least check if this gemstone works upstairs. I'm not going to explore the rest of the island, I don't think, because... Meh. Um, Was it down? No, wait, it was up. It was up. This one... I don't think we ever even found like that shipwreck, did we? What's a gemstone? Okay, well, I happen to have a gemstone. Place the gem in the console. Party lost Nehru's gem. Oh wait, is that what we had to do to open this? Okay, okay, well. I guess that was just part of the main quest line, not even anything fancy, nothing fun. Oh well, <laughs> let's go talk to the dude and get the hell off this island. Maybe maybe the next area will be enchanting, much more interesting. I imagine it's gonna be more of the same. I don't have particularly high hopes to be honest. Hey, I got your gem and things, dude. You ready? My airship will be in the palace by dawn. Uh, then let's I'll go. Order my ship to sail for Halasar. Watch our ship be there. Like by the time we get there, didn't even need a flying ship. And this is fancy. Look at it, glowing all green and stuff. All the sparks. Very cool. Oh, wait, we're on the waterfall? <laughs> okay. Then why do we even have to ask? Obviously it flies. How else did he, or would he have gotten it up here? Is it like a messed up scorpion or something? What did it just turn into? It's an interesting design for a ship, man. To the Palace of Halasar. Um, my controller's not dead. Yeah, no, we can't do anything Nehru's as far as moving. So, sea, I guess we're entering the palace. Waves. As I marveled at the magic that held our boat aloft, Sangal whispered a dire warning. Only the unseen, the mysterious guards of the Minari, could have contrived such a vessel. We spied the shores of Halasar by the light of the rising sun and parted ways at the palace. For Nero's help, I owed him a prisoner, though I'd have to catch him first. Yeah, I gotta be honest, man. I think I'm pretty much done with this game already. It's not that good. It's, it's not terrible either. It's just like the last game, you know, the combat, it, it's probably better than the last one. But so far, there's been like a tiny bit of lore, most of which I'm not really following because it's talking about places and things I, I have no connection to. And then combat, and that's your it. Grace, and the combat's the just so basic. Desire. There's no Any weight to it. Kosi? Our armies will engage the enemy at the sepulcher. The general awaits your arrival. Then I must find Torgus. Where is he? In the sparring room, your grace. Sadama Kier also desires a word with you. You'll find her in the Sanctum. Thank you, Dama Bashra. With faith and valor, your grace. Mm. Wait, where'd our... Oh, we lost our dude? Why's our dude gone? That sucks. Noodle, thank you for the five bits. Appreciate you.
Uh, planning to be done around three. That was the plan. I might be done a little earlier just because I'm tired and this game is not helping that in any way. The Shadow Clan sent her to kill me. Now she's my dearest friend. Nice. Okay. Oh, wait. What? Dama Bashira's servants just made the bed. I hope for something less flowery. Well, aren't you like the princess or whatever? Why don't you just tell them that? Like, yo, could I get not flower bed sheets next time? Why? What's up? I'm leaving for the sepulchre. Torgus and Sangaril are coming with me. You have 50,000 warriors at your command. You needn't bloody your hands. I have nothing to fear. I am the goddess Lahara Reborn. Do not put destiny to the test with your reckless ways. Your last adventure was foolish and vain. I found the Book of the Prophets, didn't I? You are the queen of Halasar. Our you queen, not princess, so though. Others may die in your name. <laughs> yeah, that's the only Tell reason we rule. To get others you. killed. How did I become that creature? We shall discuss this when you return. Now you must speak the right of the prophets. Or updated. Quest journal updated. All the updates. Lahara walked the desert of 30 suns. And in a stone, she trapped them all but one. In the sand, she sowed the seed from which the tree of Ela grew. Aosi is the wind that blows through its branches. With blood, sand, and a branch of the tree, Lahara made the first born. Halasa is the kingdom where they dwelled, and so we are their children. With our eyes, we see the wind that sings through Ela's branches. Wouldn't everybody's be, everybody the be their children the fears, if they're, like, the, storm the firstborn? The tree of Ela. Lahara wept as the long night fell and darkness devoured her children. How to heal the broken tree? How to mend the branches? Lahara sailed from Halasar to dream the silent mystery. In the ninth century of the ninth age, a child of the mark is born. That us? Lahara, I feel like that's us. Queen mm -hmm. and savior. Halasar shall rise from the tomb of the righteous, for she is the goddess reborn. So it is written in the book of the prophets. And before we're actually not. Hate to see it, man. <laughs> Sucks to be you, I guess. Why, though, did it even have us do, like, the palace section? Like, normally I'm a fan of not having everything done in cutscenes. But, okay, it did bring us back. I thought it was just going to teleport us away. I was going to say, like, if it's just going to be short cutscene, walk down a hallway, cutscene, and then we're gone, then what's even the point? Just... Just show us a cutscene and take us straight to the wherever we're going next, desert or whatever, but never mind. It's fine. If we actually get to like explore and do stuff here, then that's yeah. Since I've returned to heal the tree of elm, if only I knew how. Um guessing branches and blood or something. How big is this place? We have like a full map of it, right? Yeah. Okay. Master of Arms. Ah, oh, so wait, are there some shops? I do actually want to check the shops before we get out. Before we get out, before we get off. Grace, nothing would give me greater pleasure than doing something. Don't really care. Uh, you play songs. Songs are magical. Okay, so we can give you some stuff, it seems like. So, like, if we give you the gold case... We just have to talk to you again? No. Okay, what about... What about the, the sheet music? Sorry, Grace, but this song is to mourn. I cannot read the notes. Mm. Well, you're useless to me, aren't you? Hmm. Okay. I think the shops were down this way, no? Maybe not. This looks more like a palace room or something. 
Ah, okay. Oh no, that's probably the Master yes. Arms. Who is buried in the Imperial Sepulchre? Please, no more lessons. Answer me. Oh, you pedantic bag of wind. You treat me as if I were a child. The answer is Githerun the first. You're impossible. And what did Githerun achieve? He banished the new Vasarim. Ah, splendid. And he founded the Empire of Galdir, which for 2,000 years has ruled these lands. Until? Until Maya, the child of prophecy, ascended to the throne of Halasar at the age of four as the goddess Lahara reborn. No thanks to you. Ah, your ignorance of history is appalling. I just realized they actually uh, lip synced him a little bit. Or all of these. I guess, like, actual cutscenes, maybe, but the rest of it, not so much. Sangral's coming with us. Is she? The sepulchre is an ancestral tomb. I pray she will not drip on the floor. More lore updated. I just want a shop, man. Can I, like, buy anything from you people? Barring teacher and weapon master. I mean, I imagine we probably wouldn't have to buy stuff from our own weapon stores, but... Uh, choose your fighter. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't mean to... I didn't mean to do this! I was just clicking through options! What if we just keep constantly spamming? I think we, we figured out how to win, man. You just spam, it's fine. No, <laughs> okay, no, he is getting hits in. There is like a bit of a stun if we get the hit in first, but. Hey, we got a ring out. Shouldn't that be a win? And, oh, bro, he's dead. Come on. Make him drop some treasure or something. We did murder him. How oh, was that? Okay. Well fought, you are victorious. Yeah, no shit. Uh, do you wish to spore? N spore? Spar? No. Damn. That's the bodyguard, bro. He's not gonna have anything new to fight. say, I doubt. He waits. Yeah, no. Damn, so maybe there aren't any shops around here, actually. Order priest, nothing. Court musician, teacher, officer of the court, priestess of healers, priest of the seal, assassin, world map. General Kosi's aide de camp? Uh what that is. Priestess of the coin? Maybe? Or exotic goods? Probably not though. Um Yeah. No. I don't think there are actually any shops here, sadly. Can we leave this place? I'm gonna guess no, but we keep going down. You gotta get to the exit sooner or later, right? I guess technically we could be like in the basement, but yeah, no, nothing there. This is more or less the right way. It's all it goes. Yeah, it seems to be at least. Perfect. Now, which one of you is leader, master of coin, or whatever? My caravans have just returned. Shall I show you what they brought? Yeah! Okay, we did find one. So, they sell action potion, cure potion, and health potions. That's... That's it? Oh, no, okay. They do have scrolls and stuff, too. Uh, basic spells, revive, scan, mastery chain. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Necklace increases intelligence when equipped. Okay, so basic tethered noose. What? <laughs> okay. And po just potions, scrolls, and miscellaneous. That's it. Now, how much do you buy stuff for? Um, wait, 250 for a scan scroll? How much is it to buy one? Uh, 500. Okay. That seems like a lot for, for that. I don't know. Mission scrolls, miscellaneous. 
Brain worm, small ruby. Yeah. Nah, nothing really of interest. Anyways, guys, if I stay on here, I'm going to fall asleep. So we're going to call it there. Uh, Summoner 2, not as bad as I was expecting going into it, but also not good. Definitely full of jank. Uh, not very engaging. The lore maybe would be more interesting if I had finished the first game. But, like, yeah, it's whatever. It's a solid, like, you know, little below average game. Two, maybe three if you're feeling super generous. I'm gonna not fall asleep, though, so <laughs> have a good night, guys. And uh, I'll be back in a couple of days for something, probably, if I don't fall asleep then, too. <laughs> be kind to each other, y'all. Bye! When, when do I get the, the make out social option, dude? What level do we need to be at? Can I sing? I'll try to serenade him. I can't tell if he's being receptive right now. Okay, yeah, no, he liked it. He liked it. That worked. That got him going. Smooch argues through handshake. I just want to make out with you, my guy.